Ed, a U.S. court hears about a terror plot with a Canadian connection. The bouncing baby boy with a lot of bounce. Plus this. Um. The incredible journey of a regimental flag from Afghanistan to space to Edmonton and the story it tells. Most flags fly high, but few have flown quite as high as the one in this story. It was taken aboard a space shuttle and launched into orbit as a tribute to four Canadian soldiers who lost their lives in the early days of the mission to Afghanistan. Today, the flag arrived home at the military base those men once called their own. Linda Calvert was there. When the time came for a moment, Joe Green just um, couldn't find the words. Whew, there's no words uh, to describe. Uh, what a prestigious honor it has been. To it's be been a long journey for him, for the 3rd Battalion, Princess Patricia's Canadian Light Infantry, and this flag. Go ahead there, Here we go. Oh, yeah. All right. So, <laughs> the flag has traveled from Kandahar to outer space, and now will hang here in the battalion's drill hall. Every day that uh, they come in here, they circulate in here, they go on parade, you know, they can look at that flag and when they're down and, you know, and they see it. In April 2002, four soldiers from the battalion were killed in so-called friendly fire. Half a world away, the news so moved Green, an artist, he started an online memorial. Within a week, more than 50,000 Canadians had sent their condolences. To thank him, the soldiers in Kandahar signed their flag and sent it to him. And that's when Green got a really far out idea. Send the flag into orbit. And the Canadian Space Agency agreed to do it. Yeah, Joseph, send us the flag. We want to show our support. And as soon as I heard that, just like, oh, like, oh, oh. you know, it's one of those oh moments, right? And lift off. In 2006, Canadian astronaut Steve McLean took the flag with him. Talk about one of those moments. But after all it had been through, Green felt the flag wasn't his any longer. It belonged here. Today, I think that this flag uh, represented a uh, real milestone for our country in terms of the outpouring of support and, and, and collective awareness of what uh, Canada's troops do overseas. Green honoured their sacrifices, and now the battalion is returning that respect, making him an honorary member of the regiment. Linda Calvert, CBC News. Edmonton.